Hey everybody, Rick Needham handicapping thoroughbred racing from the classy Del Mar Thoroughbred Club on Friday, August the 12th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle Southern California Thoroughbred Racing Report. Let's go to the Race 7 feature this evening, folks, 7 p.m. Pacific post time. Just a reminder on Fridays that Del Mar in the summertime, post time for race number one is 4 p.m. This is the Daisy Cutter Handicap, five furlong sprint on the turf, fillies and mares, three years old, and up racing for a stakes purse of $85,000. Contenders number one on Zip Me, number three, Gavine, number six, Separate Forest, and number seven, Waveline. Number one on Zip Me is both the overall speed and pace profile leader in this stakes field tonight, sprinting at her about five furlongs on the grass, has hit the board in each of her last five starts, Four of those efforts, including back-to-back -back wins in her third and fourth races back, also qualifying as power runs. Jockey Rafael Bejarano has been in her irons on eight previous occasions, hitting the board in each, winning five times en route to a positive 45% return on investment in the process. He's back this evening for ride number nine. Number three, Gavine, a French bred entry, has hit the board in three of her last five outings, including a power run win in her second race back. Race 7 summary, number 1 on Zip Me, tops my contenders list, which also includes number 3, Gavine, number 6, Separate Forest, and number 7, Waveline, 1367 in the 7th from Del Mar, the $85,000 Daisy Cutter Handicap. Bonus long shots, Fairmont Park, race two, the six to one shot, number six, Bella's Castle, qualifies as a Trackmaster plus Power Pony, is the overall speed leader in this claiming field, sprinting at six furlongs on the dirt. Canterbury Park, race one, number two, Unchain the Train, five to one on the morning line, is better speed, sprinting at six furlongs on the dirt than the favorite, number four, Miguel Baby. So from Del Mar on a Friday, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.